Hello and welcome. My name is Roshan and I'm from the learning and development team at Quest. Along with me in conversation is Sunil Deshpande. Sunil, welcome and very excited to be speaking with you. Roshan, it's indeed a, a great pleasure and, uh, and uh, you know, talking to you, spending time with you, uh, I think has never been boring. So uh, I look forward uh, to the next uh, whatever time you have today. Thank you. And also congratulations on completing 20 wonderful years in Quest. So tell me in one word, one feeling word, how do you feel about completing 20 years with Quest? Young. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> and so wishing you many wonderful and more successful years in Quest. Thank so, you very much. Yeah. So taking the conversation forward, Sunil. You started your career by selling machine tools prior to joining Quest as a project engineer doing analysis. You learned what was required in Quest before getting into the project. You've also worn different hats working with delivery, TEG, SSG, and currently you are the sales strategy and solutions leader. So I have two questions for you. How has your journey been and how have the different roles that you played shaped you into the person that you are today? Uh, so, um, yes, these, uh, these 20 years, uh, uh, I think have been, uh, uh, very enriching, uh, Roshan. And, uh, the very first thing, uh, which I remember in this journey is, uh, uh, I, uh, I went to this, uh, training academy called McTrack. Uh, that, in my opinion, is uh, serendipity for me. Okay, um, I, uh, mm, I I still feel, um, you know, this 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 is a place which kind of uh, made me what I am today. Uh, it made me relevant. It made me um, ready for for any organization to absorb. And uh, I think this this kind of an uh, initiative is uh, very much needed even today. Um, we have everything uh, to get our uh, uh, fresh engineers up and running. But when I joined Quest, I was already like about four years experience. Uh, as you said, I was selling machine tools. I didn't know anything about uh, what Quest did. And then one of the managers said that, uh, hey, why do these guys come here? and uh, um, I don't know how they're going to pick up speed and then this this magic happened right uh, so and you proved him wrong <laughs> not really but uh, yes everybody everybody wants uh, people to be relevant at the time when they join you right? and, and and he i think did the right thing and uh, and uh, there were like wonderful people uh, who uh, uh, made it very uh, uh, memorable for me at the uh, training academy and uh, then you know there was no looking back uh, after that right um i uh, i just uh, chronologically if i if i kind of uh, uh, look into uh, what happened um i i uh, went on to do engineering in my uh, first role um my biggest learning there was uh, always you must be uh, passionate to tell people what you have done. Okay, um, I would call it as selling your work, and 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 it is uh, you have to do it on an everyday basis, and uh, that is when you know uh, you find the uh, great answers uh, for the work what you are doing, and then uh, you also convey a, a, a great story. Um, and and so my my first ten years with um, where I was doing engineering. Uh, taught me taught me a lot of things how to respect my work how to how to kind of uh, convey my work to others um, which I believe uh, uh, engineers uh, should do it uh, it's not that just the marketing people will will communicate somebody's work but uh, we should we should communicate our work um, my next stint was with uh, uh, technology excellence and uh, developing processes. Um, processes are important to scale, um, Roshan. 
and the overdoing processes can slow you down. Uh, so that 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 appreciation for the right balance there is uh, one of the key things, uh, if you ask me. Um, then um, I think uh, they felt that I could be uh, into a customer facing kind of a role. So I was not honestly uh, front ending any any businesses, but uh, uh, I was uh, I was into building solutions, and um, and it was like uh, hard work. Uh, some of the some of the work what we landed or some of the clients what we landed um, is uh, is very memorable and uh, I got to work with uh, great people during that time. Uh, so that taught me the importance of uh, uh, what kind of a what kind of an organization goes uh, if you have to land a customer or if you to, if you have to win win a dollar. Right, and um, it's not uh, it's not uh, easy. Uh, my last three years have been uh, to to put an organization around new business development, and uh, again, um, I think uh, uh, why will customers work with you? Who are those right people to reach out to? Uh, there's never been a straight answer, so we're continuing to persist on that. But um, but it's been. It's been again teaching a lot of things uh, on an everyday basis, uh, Roshan. Uh, so overall, I would say, um, you know, the areas where I've worked in, uh, there has been always a lot of uncertainty, and the uh, organization has been very patient. The people around me have been uh, extremely uh, helpful, and uh, that is what uh, has made these 20 years uh, uh, just pass passed away and uh, I, I don't know uh, uh, how 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 much I learned during this time and uh, it's it'll it'll stay with me and uh, that's that's uh, a summary of my 20 years Roshan. Absolutely I remember you saying in your 20 year speech the phenomenal opportunities you got in Quest and as you mapped your journey over the last two decades I could see all of it coming through. Yeah. So, so thank you for sharing. But do tell me, um, was there any role that you enjoyed more than others, and uh, what has kept you motivated and going strong in Quest? Uh, yeah, uh, I enjoyed. Uh, uh, I enjoyed um, my engineering role the best. Uh, because in that role, Roshan, uh, at the end of the day or at the end of the week. Uh, you create something and uh, it is absorbed by, um, so I have the privilege to work on some very advanced uh, uh, machines. And uh, um, even, even if, you, if you contribute um, a new bracket or a new um, casing, you know, it's, uh, it's uh, so much of a, uh, so much of a satisfaction. And, uh, I think at the end of the day, you get to see your your work um, and 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 the parts what you designed are flying, right? And uh, um, so that's that's uh, that's that's been very uh, close to my heart. Uh, I don't regret what I'm doing today, uh, but um, you know, going going to your other question of what motivates you on a daily basis, <clears throat> um, I think. Um, what I want to do is uh, I want to build mechanisms uh, for the business, right? And um, I don't have uh, answers for many questions uh, today. Um, so why do we win? Why do we don't win, right? Um, how do we how do we get uh, the great work what is done across the global organization? And uh, we are able to talk to a lot of people. Uh, how do I build build a, um, a mechanism to cross sell? Uh, so the number of questions are more than the answers what I have, and um, and it is it is fascinating if if I can I can find at least few answers uh, uh, to to the problems, and that's what keeps me uh, kind of uh, going and. Uh, I'm blessed with uh, uh, with uh, wonderful people around me. Uh, there's been great leadership which has been inducted into the organization recently, 
and uh, i think it will all come together and uh, at least uh, some of my questions will be answered it's good to see your curiosity still so strong and having said that moving on you know there's an african proverb which says it takes a village to raise a child and you did talk about uh, the ecosystem around you and if you were to extend this village to the organization's context who are the mentors the leaders the teams that you worked with um who have had the biggest influence on you and what did they do that stood out and still stands out and is very relevant mm. um maybe i'll consume uh, most of uh, your uh, time today if i start taking uh, everybody's names um and uh, it's not it's not just the leaders uh, who have been uh, very inspiring uh, um you know i i am I'm inspired by um anyone who shows high commitment anyone who shows um dedication and um you know some of my my leaders i think if i were to pick some of the common traits what they exhibit uh, roshan um you know my my best mentors my best uh, um well wishers uh, have always created opportunity for me um and um, and it is uh, it is it is um, you know so overwhelming because uh, that's when you know it it is it creates a playground for you to uh, come in and participate and all of that um the other uh, very important thing uh, uh, what uh, what i have had the privilege uh, is um they always have time for me uh, and and not that uh, um, not that they are less busy Uh, but uh, they are so flexible they always uh, always uh, want to give that uh, time for me and uh, they are always there when i fail i think being there for you always and creating opportunities um, what more what more will will one need right and uh, that's that's a part uh, uh, the folks around me so i'm 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 very thankful to to everyone who's uh, uh given me an opportunity to work with them and then um you know create something m- meaningful and memorable for them i'm sure they all realize that uh, but thank you for putting it very clearly yeah. um you you worked on some a very important uh, component for an aircraft engine what were some of the challenges and how did you handle uh, them there was a village behind me and um, you know everybody there would have been about 50 people who would have worked on this project roshan and and everybody was willing to kind of uh, help and then help me succeed and then get me to the finish line and um, I, i i will talk a little bit about uh, about uh, some of the some of the learnings what i have had but this was this was uh, an unforgettable uh, uh, time for me it took about uh 12 to 14 months to design redesign this part uh but uh, without without people around me i don't think i would have I would have done this so moving on uh, sunil uh, can you name one or two moments that you had with customers which very vividly stands out for you even today um yeah yeah okay um so so this is uh, uh this is one of our largest customers uh very early days of uh, engagement and um and and you know there used to be a lot of people a lot of senior execs from this company who would come and uh, spend time with us and uh, for them seeing was believing you know if um, if if uh, 5000 miles away from where their products were built um if uh, if engineering was done uh, it was not easy for somebody to uh, to just absorb that uh, so i later on came to know that one gentleman who had come to see us um he was that uh, brain behind uh, this this uh, uh, outsourcing okay and um, so he had conceptualized everything and uh, all of that and then one evening he comes uh, to to our facility 
and then i was there so they they brought him to talk to me um and then i kept on uh, i i explained him my work and how we were progressing and uh, in my narrative i was telling uh, we did this and then we went to the design review we did that and things like that i said uh, then he was curious he asked me uh, what do you mean by uh, we who is this we then i said uh, this is uh, i and and my client counterpart um on the other end and then i'm i i work like an extended uh, uh, team to to him and then uh, we are in, in in my opinion making significant progress on this uh, work and i tell you he was so delighted he 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 made a fist and then he put a stamp on my forehead he said here you go ma'am you you kind of realize uh, uh my dream and then i just makes uh, it just makes it so um you know i'm so relieved about uh, about how you guys are uh, talking and all of that and um and it went on to become very big for me from there on for for us from there onwards and uh, i think that's something which um, i will never forget um and then um i uh, so i and uh, my colleague umesh uh, uh, once we um we had to go to a client meeting at 5 am okay 5 am and um, so we got ready at 4 we had to drive for another 40, 30 40 minutes and, and sharp like 10 10 to 5 we were there and then um this this client uh, uh, who comes receives us um she has a coffee for us and uh, she has synthesized all the notes from our previous discussions and she is kind of uh, ready at 5 to to kind of go into the meeting now 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 look at the commitment you know i, I, I we were thinking oh i am we're waking up at 4 and then we are we're going to this meeting and 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 this executive uh, lady she she kind of um was uh, was super uh, ready and the first thing as, as the meeting starts we get a rundown because of because of what we had done on the previous day and then why uh, it was insufficient and all of that uh, so so it's it's um, it's great to kind of see the world around you and um, and just see right how, how much more committed people are how much more sacrifices people do and uh, and and that has gone quite long uh, into into my memory roshi in terms of how um, you know uh, how success is built right it's not easy it's it's it, it needs it needs an extraordinary amount of uh, uh, commitment and uh, sacrifice No, oh, absolutely, and um, you know, I mean, I'm glad you brought out both these different experiences or instances because um, you know, all kind of exp- experiences teach us and shape us, and it needn't be uh, the perfect one. Sometimes, you know, some things where um, there are some there's room for improvement is also an opportunity to do something better. Yeah. So, so yeah. great to have you speaking about this. Yeah. So now, excellent, you- excellent, Rohan. um is a word which we use uh, so casually but uh, uh, excellence uh, doesn't come easy and um, i think uh, i think that's okay. where we are headed yeah so switching gears a bit sunil someone who's worked with you talks about your phenomenal attention to details so how do you do it is this natural or did you train yourself to um, to get this level of eye for details yeah and um and a lot of a uh, lot of my a uh, lot of people with whom i work they tell you that is such a pain to work with and then uh, some people think that i spend a lot of time uh i i i, I just love it but um, but there has been quite a bit of reinforcement roshan uh, to this uh, habit of uh, mine um so i was uh, i was in germany uh, we were doing a workshop with a client and 
and and and we were in a in a drawing office okay uh, so so there is a there's a lady there uh, the client executive who kind of runs this drawing office and um, a drawing office uh, in a refinery right you just need to store everything every single piece of information data drawing etc uh, for as long as this refinery lives right and uh, everything around around her was uh, so so clean and so nice and and she could just uh, get up and then uh, pick something from 1964 or 65 and things like that. Right? so that was amazing you know? and then we were we were supposed to be um, uh, collecting the requirements Mm, so we we spoke to her said that hey we understand what your stated requirements are can you tell me uh, what are some of your implied requirements and things like that and then she uh, she spreads her drawing uh, in front of us uh, and 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 she said like yeah I, i don't know how to tell you but i must see peace in my drawings okay and uh, that was like uh, that was that was uh, you know it took a, it took it took us by surprise um, are drawings talking to you are drawings having emotions uh, what do you mean by drawings uh, have to have to have peace in them right and uh, it's uh, it's th- th- that's what she was saying right uh, the layout and, and then how you how you kind of uh, position the views and and these are not difficult things uh, roshan it's uh, it's just um, applying yourself um, there are today a lot of tools etc to beautify your work um, so it just doesn't take time as people think uh, but um, but it's an attitude and uh, and and nothing wrong with cultivating this attitude is all i can say it, it just does so so many good things for you Sunil all i can say is um, you know i can definitely understand the need for i for details but with respect to organization i have taken a note for myself to organize my folders in the laptop <laughs> uh, and see if there if i can see peace in the entire uh, scheme of things yeah. but yeah. i will give it a try yeah. um uh, moving on um, can you talk about or list the positive see, uh, positive changes that you've seen in quest over the last 20 years yeah uh you know the journey from being a analysis organization to where we are um i think we are evolving uh, uh i would say we are we are evolving into uh, something magical roshan um we are evolving into that fusion of uh, engineering and uh, digital uh we just need to get things together in a right way but uh, we got all the foundational foundational blocks there um that's uh, that's in my opinion uh, uh which is uh, happened well um i'm also um very uh, um very happy of we um uh, we retaining our uh, identity um you know as an engineering only uh, organization it's very important there are so many distractions around us but uh, that will prevail uh, uh, roshan uh, in in the decades and decades to come um i'm also um, seeing uh, influx of some great people in the organization um i just hope uh, we will make it um, very memorable for them in the early days um and uh, and 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 we can learn from them to to swing this organization uh into into a formidable force uh, uh, to to reckon so that's that's what i would see oh definitely i mean we are trying our best to make it very memorable and yeah. uh, making sure that you know what you learned in the last 20 years they are able to catch up in 6 months yeah. so hopefully um we are on the right track um we did talk about experiences sunil um saying that experience is a big teacher and every experience makes one grow can you highlight a few lessons that you learned over your last um two decades or your journey something which young questions can um you know can use as they build their career in quest 
యా రోస్తం ఐ ఐ స్టార్ట్ మై డే విత్ అ ప్రేయర్ ఓకే అండ్ మై ప్రేయర్ ఇస్ అస్ సింపుల్ అస్ దిస్ రైట్ సో అట్ క్వెస్ట్ వీ ఆర్ వీ ఆర్ బిల్డింగ్ సంథింగ్ యూనిక్ ఓకే and um, we are not here uh, to outbeat each other and uh, if we can harness uh, the abilities of each other and uh, build something which is uh, worthwhile right and um, then, then that's the purpose right so keeping every of your ego or uh, um you know everything back and then if you if you come and uh, open your uh, uh, laptop or uh, your desktop with uh, this prayer uh, i think we'll create wonders and uh, um so that's that's one thing uh, second thing i would say to my engineers is uh, guys uh, e- each one of you whatever piece of work we are doing right uh learn to sell it to yourself learn to sell it to your your neighbors learn to sell it to your manager uh i i, I mean when, when i say sell it's all about um having the ability to talk to that work right uh, is very important uh, roshan for uh, each one of us and um ask for help um i some of the best work which i have done uh is uh, best work and the work which has succeeded i've done is uh, with the help of others okay um, a fleet of uh, helicopters were grounded and uh, the 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 because of a failure right and because of a crash and then uh, there was something wrong with the gearbox and then um, they asked us to investigate and then uh provide uh, provide an answer as to what was what could be happening there uh and i'll tell you on a trot um it, 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 I, we spent about 36 hours roshan uh, we slept in the uh, in the library <laughs> and uh, and and those days you know it was uh, the, our machines were uh, couldn't handle as much of uh, of power as they do today but uh, and and then you know Uh, i my my uh, partner in crime at that time uh, uh, sanjay bk i think uh, but for him and but for his persistence his ideas etc i don't think we would have succeeded uh, uh, in doing that so uh, help is just a shout away for for any one of us right and uh, never give up um, many a times we will be solving the problems um, uh, for the first time and um, you know with with a combination of all of this um, you will succeed right and uh, um, so so never give up so that's that's uh, that's the mantra um, and it's uh, it's simple i think uh, it's not simple but god will prayer um, is answered and i i, I think that's um, you really important the fact that you said that you know we are here to build something unique not to beat each other yeah, and yeah. Uh, to use each other's abilities to create that something worthwhile so sunil um, can you paint a picture of um, where you see quest and yourself 10 years from now 10 years from today yeah uh, <laughs> we will be world class uh, roshan and uh, we will build a centenary organization so so i i i imagine like this right we'll be world class in in a few things um by that what i mean is uh, everybody everybody in, on on this planet um who needs that that uh, help right will will come to us and uh, we will solve we will solve these complex problems for them um as i stand today roshan um i think if we if we do things well um our customers today are uh, threatened by uh, the um you know disruption which is being caused uh, in their respective industries right 
and uh, we know the domain, we know the technology. If we can marry both these things and and um, help our our clients uh, weather this disruption, uh, I think we'll be world class in uh, in that area. So um, there will be someone who is uh, who will be very special person in uh, in, the, in in ten years to come. And, and where do you see yourself, Sunil, in this? Ah. Uh, Okay, I um, I need to uh, I will continue my journey to find answers to questions. And as I told you earlier, uh, I want to be good at building mechanisms. I want to be good at um, you know uh, solving problems for the uh, for the business. Uh, I don't see. I don't, I, I don't know. Honestly, uh, the the uh, hierarchy, role, etc. They don't uh, they don't uh, excite me. But uh, mm, if I can I can solve the the problems which whichever people have, and I know some of the problems which we have, I'm not going to be able to solve in, in three months or six months. It's going to take time. So uh, I just want to get predictable. Um, organization has shown a lot of patience uh, in me. Uh, I think it's time for me to uh, kind of give back that recipe uh, of solving uh, solving problems for them. Yeah. All right, um, Sunil, thank you so much for helping us gain insight into your journey and experiences. And um, you know, I mean, just so that you know, I'm going to take you up on my offer of um, you know i mean you wanting to look into or you know explore the world of uh, learning and development but i'm yeah. sure besides that um, you know for all the folks watching there's been some great takeaways um from this particular conversation um you know sunil so wishing you good luck and godspeed in all your endeavors um you spoke about us in evolving into something really magical and we believe as always the best of quest is yet to come so thank yeah, you for your yeah. time and uh, have a wonderful day. Hey, Roshan, thank you uh, for giving me this opportunity to express myself. And, uh, you know, I just hope that uh, uh, there are there are like thousands of people in Quest who are much better than me. Um, but, but uh, you know, together, uh, I feel we can uh, we can make this uh, a wonderful place. Um, I want to see uh, what's a billion dollar organization. So that's, that's uh, yet another reason which kind of keeps me uh, going on, Roshan. And uh, I'm sure together we'll, we'll build this and uh, we'll take this to much more greater heights. So, so thank you very much. Absolutely. Thank you and take care. Uh, you too.